A question that many of us have asked is why are we here? It's perhaps one question that we'll never have an answer for. It's unknown why we're here, but one thing that is known is that the human body is incredible. Two leading scientists have come forward and said the human brain is a biological computer, and the consciousness of a human being is a program that runs by the brain's computer. It's believed that within the human brain there resides around 86 billion brain cells. The soul is something that's made many people put forward different theories. Another recent study has shown researchers that electrodes can record the brain's electrical activity. This newly developed graphene-based implant can record electrical activity in the brain at extremely low frequencies. It's able to map brain activity in different regions and this will allow us to understand what it looks like when everything is working. Incredibly, this new technology doesn't interfere with normal brain function. It's allowed us to see crucial information about different events. For example, epileptic seizures and strokes. This is a massive jump forward in regards to understanding how our brain functions. It's still early days, but it's thought this new technology will get used a lot in the future. Over the years, there has always been debate about the soul of a human, and whether or not it goes on after life. There are those that believe your soul is what's keeping you alive, while others suggest the soul is nothing. However, recently researchers think they've found a new truth about the soul. They've put forward the theory that the soul doesn't die, it goes back into the universe. Dr. Stuart Hamroff, who is a physicist, and Sir Roger Penrose, a mathematical physicist at the Oxford University, have been working on the quantum theory of consciousness. Both of them suggest the soul of a person is in the microtubules of the brain cells. Their theory states that a human being's soul is contained within the cells of the brain and structures that are inside them. It sounds confusing, but the doctors think the human brain is just a biological computer, and the consciousness we experience is run by the computer inside the brain. This means it will continue to exist after the human is gone. Both of them suggest that what humans think of consciousness is the result of the effects of quantum gravity that is situated in the microtubules. Consciousness is perhaps the biggest mystery. After all, no one knows what happens when you pass away but many do believe that consciousness goes back into the universe. The universe created you, and when it's your time, you go back into the universe. So what do you guys make of this theory? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.